So here we have the new and refreshed 2022 GMC Sierra 1500. And this is your work truck model. So this is the pro trim level. Comes in summit white on jet black vinyl interior. And the powertrain on this one consists of a 2.7 liter high output turbocharged four cylinder engine made it to an eight speed automatic transmission. So we're gonna get around to this front end here. And we have LED daytime running lights along with LED projector headlamps there. And down here we have our 17 inch steel wheels. Here we have controls for power door locks, power windows, power mirrors. And then here we have our headlamp controls, four wheel drive controls, electronic parking brake. And there is our driver's seat there. top of the back seat here of course we get vinyl flooring with this one and then plenty of leg room back here me being 6'3 have several inches of headroom and then a couple inches of leg room here and the seat in front of me is adjusted for someone of my size but next we're gonna go ahead and check out the window sticker There we have it there. And most importantly, this one has the pro value package. So you get the tinted glass, cruise control, trailer package, and then the easy lift tailgate. And then we also have the connectivity and entertainment package. So we get the wireless Apple CarPlay, the Android Auto. And then we have a $225 package here, which includes a 120 volt bed mounted power outlet, which we'll check out here momentarily. There's our back end there, which carries over from the 19 and up model year. And there's that 120 volt three prong household plug in there. There's our front passenger seat there. And for a truck that stickers under 45 grand, it's a lot of money, but it's better than paying upwards of 60 for a few more options. Um, a few more bells and whistles and a little bigger engine because this has everything you need really in my opinion. Well, there's that 2.7 liter turbocharged four cylinder. And now we're gonna check out the interior. So there's our steering wheel there. And what I will say is I really like how they have their forward collision gap adjust. You can adjust here. And then um, some other safety features that we'll test out here in a minute. 
But over here we have our radio. So we get AM, FM, XM, along with Bluetooth audio, and then we have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto wirelessly as well. And just to show you the Apple CarPlay, you can pull up the main menu here, shows all the apps that are compatible with it. And then we'll just take a quick listen, check out the sound system here. So for a stock system, really good, clear quality sound there, especially the bass, that was quite impressive. And there's our backup camera there and we have the guidelines that turn with the steering wheel as you turn it. And then down here we have our climate controls and we have a knob to adjust fan speed, same thing with temperature. What I really like is you can cut the system on and off by pressing a button, it's pretty simple. We don't have to turn all the way to one side or whatever. We have lane departure, auto stop, we can lower that tailgate, traction control hazards. And then we have a, another three prong household plug-in right here for 120, I believe. And we have a USB-C, USB-A input along with a 12 volt there. So as you can see, there really is a lot of technology even in this base model work truck here. There's our glove compartment there with owner's manuals. And here's our top cubby there. So this one didn't necessarily carry over the refresh interior for the higher trim levels, but it did carry over quite a few safety features. But here's that column shifter that we're used to, reverse, neutral drive, and then put in a low mode and we can shift manually here with that eight speed. And then we have our cruise controls here. Like I said, that forward collision gap adjust. There's our gauge cluster. But what's really awesome is for the Pro, we finally get push button start. And then we also carry over the new and improved key fob. But next we're gonna go ahead and take this 2.7 liter four cylinder Sierra 1500 Pro out on the road for a test drive. I just love the blow off valve for the turbo engine here. It just sounds so, it sounds like a big old Duramax and I really like that. And one thing I can say is the eight speed pair with this turbo four, it just feels so fast. Like it feels ridiculous. And as you can see, it really does get up with minimal effort. Pretty good ride quality. Not being blown all over the interstate here, which is nice.
and all in all pretty good sound acoustics within the cab and I'm not having to yell to talk to the person next to me which is nice And then we have the distance indicator that just came up and as you can see it's green there to show that I'm not too close to the vehicle in front of me which is really nice especially on a full-size work truck like this and there's the auto stop that just cut on Yeah, I just love the sound that the engine makes. Specifically that turbo. It just sounds really, really aggressive. Well, like I said earlier, I really like all that you get. It's still expensive, which it's expensive for anything these days, but 45 grand for a full-size pickup truck isn't bad, but especially with all the technology you get, specifically the safety technology that is starting to become more and more prevalent in all vehicles, just coming standard with forward collision alert, lane departure, etc. And finally, we have a push button start, which is, I mean, for 45 grand, we should have push button start on a vehicle. So I'm glad that GM finally stepped it up and is starting to make it more prevalent in its lineup. Because the outgoing model, you had 21s and 22 limiteds that still had keys. And a lot of the consumers, as other manufacturers come out with certain features standard they expect that if they're switching brands or whatever so i'm glad gm's at least trying to keep up but the wireless carplay the android auto the sound system in general just really nice for a work truck model and actually the vinyl seats are pretty comfortable too And this will bring me to the end of my review of the new 2022 GMC Sierra 1500 Pro.